But it's realignment. It's given us something we've never seen before. Kinston playing Duplin County schools in football, but the Vikings may not like it. They lost two heartbreakers to East Duplin and James Keenan. They're only two losses of the league in the season so far, and they hosted Wallace Rose Hill tonight. Senior night for the Vikings. And um, it would be a senior for Wallace Rose Hill who had himself a night. We're talking about Kanye Roberts. Roberts would have seven rushing touchdowns in the game. This guy is in the top 50 all time in the state in rushing and still doesn't have a D1 offer on the table. Kinston trying to come back as Holloway gets it down and then it would set up a touchdown by Corian Baker, but then it would be a night for Kanye Roberts. Again, once this play scores, Roberts Nine touchdowns on the night for number five, and Wallace Rose Hill runs past Kinston by the final of 62 to 35. East Duplin trying to uh, set up that big showdown with Wallace Rose Hill next week. The Panthers tried to stay tied. They hosted South Lenore, looking for their 29th straight win against the Blue Devils, dating back to 1985, and they would get it thanks to Avery Gaby and company. Gaby a couple of touchdowns and East Duplin no problems. They would get the 56 to nothing win over South Lenore. One other East Central Conference game, North Lenore traveled to Warsaw to take on James Keenan. And those Tigers trying to go 3-0 against Lenore County teams and they would do it thanks to Shaquan Williams. Going to get one touchdown and then it would be Hassan Cornegay with another James Keenan rolls past North Lenore by the final of 42 to 14. In the Coastal Plains Conference, Northside fresh off its Anchor Bowl win Monday night, traveled to Jones Senior for another first place showdown, and Northside taking care of business in Trenton this evening. As they would get the big victory, the kickoff going to those Trojans, and they would get stuffed. Northside gets the tackle, they get the win 47 to nothing they get the shutout. The Trojans started the night a game behind the Bath and Bellhaven boys. Uh, kickoff return. Now, what are we talking about here? Actually, this is East Carteret getting the win over Pamlico. East Carteret with the TD pass and they get the victory 21 to six. Thank you to Daniel Griffey for getting these highlights of Darren Pinner uh, to Cody Shepard and then Sean Gagnon for the touchdown as he wins at 21 to 6. Southside, no problem. They rebound and beat Lejeune 56 to nothing. All right, we still have our Blitz Battle Royale, the Blitz Battle Royale, a great one, who were kids screaming for ice cream between Croatan and Swansboro. Wait until you see these highlights. 